producing those powers. He made a promise. What, like the Time Lord promised never to interfere in the affairs of other peoples or planets? I got your head back off. You should have a little bit more respect. Hmm? Come on. Where are we? Where we were, except not. Oh. What? Branch. Yep. A bit empty, isn't it? Yes, I created a distraction. I flooded downstairs with Pokemon. You're not supposed to be here. I know, it's terrible. Sorry, I'm doing everything I can to stop me. See that? It's a signal, isn't it? It's a signal beaming into space. There was one from the New York office, too. There's something in low orbit. They did book a restaurant. I'm not comfortable in restaurants. I suppose you get a lot of stairs just like that. Right back at you. You sure you're warm enough? Yeah. Okay, no. <laughs> now? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, blue orbit. But you can't get a fix on it? Try. The shield is too good. But can't we track the signals? I'm tracking them now. So what powers do you have? Well, basic flying, basic super strength. Basic x-ray vision? Yep. Is that ever tempting? Adolescence was difficult. In what sense? It went on a lot longer. How much longer? I'll let you know. <laughs> We're moving into position. It won't be long now. The ghost is located. Action the surgeons. That's what Harmony Shoal is signaling to. So we pop over and have a look? Pretty sure no one's on board. How do you know? Did you scan for life forms? No. All the lights are off. Mm -hmm. Do you have a girlfriend? Boyfriend? Well, her husband's speculation. You do fly around New York dressed in rubber with a big G on your chest. Are we very slightly stereotyping here? I get it. There's some stuff you'd like to keep private. Was it the mask that tipped you off? <laughs> How do you cope with your double life? No, nothing special. Everyone has a day job. Come on. You spend half your time as a regular person. I spend all my time that way. And the other half saving the world. How do you cope? How do you cope with a career and a baby? How do you know I have a baby? I did my research. Oh, I have a nanny. That's basically your answer. Yes, of course. He's downstairs right now. I see. And yes, I said he. Yes, you did. Yes, I did. Is that a problem? I'm sorry. It's just that guys like you sometimes find it funny a man being a nanny. With respect, Miss Fletcher, there aren't too many guys like me. There aren't too many guys like Grant either. You okay? Excuse me a minute. Jesus Christ. 